I don't think the feminist movement has ended. It has metamorphosed. It started as women, mostly white women, reacting to an art tradition and an art establishment that did not grant them the same opportunities as men. So the initial impulse was to fight the system. That meant picketing at museums and putting together all women art shows. Marsha actually participated in some of those, including Women Choose Women in 1973. The women of this period do not get the attention that they deserve. They were you know, foundational to everything else that was going on, and they still haven't gotten the attention that they deserve. With the guys, there was no competing with them. I think Marsha could handle them, but just to a certain point, you know, even though she painted all the time. The feminist movement became less essentialist, as some like to call it, where it was not so much about women as women fighting the system, but it became more of a global idea, what we call intersectionality these days, uh, where things like race, gender, economic status, physical ability, all of these things have to do with how society regards people. So we're born into different privileges. And if you're white, male, heterosexual, you have cultural privileges that are simply given to you based on those characteristics. The culture is built around these ideas. So feminism has evolved in art and in academic circles to address these larger issues. So it's not just about women being denied recognition. It's about a breadth of difference from the heterosexual white male norm that has dominated Western history. So the arc of feminism is really from a kind of grassroots movement just to recognize women to a much larger, more globally aware approach. And with the, with the new generation um, of young people, there is now starting to be more interest in claiming the feminist identity which I find interesting. The media turned it into a dirty word. So there are women who are embracing that identity now, again, which is good. Frankly, being a feminist just means you think women deserve equal opportunities. By that definition, aren't we all?